Oh, it's spooky season. I hope you guys really like my Halloween decorations I did. I worked really hard on it. Also, I found these really cool pumpkins at Christmas tree shops and I love them so much. So why not start off this spooky season with a spooky Karen story? So every October, there's a breast cancer walk at the parking lot by the lake, just a block away from my house. Every year, my school gets involved through volunteering. So this year, I decided I was going to join in. So basically, at the end of the finish line for the walk, there's a tent with water and snacks and food that is given to the people that cross the finish line. So you know, we were under the tent giving water, snacks, out all to the walkers for the breast cancer walk. That's what we were doing. So it was me, a handful of other students, and the teacher who I guess was acting as like the chaperone, whatever. So my teacher comes up to us. She's like, there's some random woman over there and I don't know who she is and she's telling me what to do. And I'm thinking to myself, what the heck is this woman doing? And I look at her, she looks crazy. So I took this terrifying picture of my teacher standing there and then the creepy lady looming behind her. That is nightmare inducing. So a little bit after that, I turn around to notice that the lady is standing inside of our tent, literally in our tent, leaning on the box of food. And then she's touching the stuff. I saw her touching other people's personal belongings that were in there. I'm just like, what is this woman doing? I tried to talk to her, ask her her name, what she was doing there. Did she work for the event? Does she work for the sponsor? No answers from her. So I go to do something else for a minute, come back. Now I noticed that my teacher had, I guess, chased her out of the tent. And my teacher's now standing there in the doorway, the entrance to the tent, and blocking it, physically blocking it with her body. And the crazy lady was walking back and forth behind my teacher and staring at us the whole time. It was so creepy. Here's some video clips of the woman just pacing back and forth. <laughs> So as the kids were taking the snacks out to give to the people, the empty boxes were going to me and I was carrying them to the dumpster and back and forth, back and forth between the dumpster and our tent. I have to go past this woman who is pacing back and forth. So I went back forth, cause nothing happened. The one time she followed me back to the dumpsters, whatever, I'm doing my thing, I go back again. And now she's like, do you need a garbage bag? No, I don't, I'm just dumping the stuff and I'm going back. I'm, I go, I'm keeping it in the boxes. She goes, well, put the box over here. I was like, no, I'm just, I'm gonna put the box over here. Ah! This woman was getting belligerent with me. So I just said, listen, you want the box over there? You can move it yourself. I have stuff to do. So I left and I went back to tent and then she follows me. So the one time as I go back to the dumpster, I recorded from the dumpster uh, this video of the woman walking all around the tent. Okay, so there she is over there. And here's all the trash I got out. Oh, no, she's heading back over towards the tent again. I have no idea what's going on, but, um, yeah. So the dumpster's filled up, and she's heading back towards the back of our tent now. See, she just walks back and forth at the back of our tent. So here's just some other creepy videos and pictures of my teacher blocking the entrance to the tent, and then the woman pacing back and forth behind her. Finally, my teacher turns around to her and I guess tells her to leave. I don't know what she said, but here's the video clip. <laughs> So yeah, that was basically that. She really didn't do anything, but judging by the look in her eyes, I'm just a little bit nervous what she could have done to us or what she could have taken if she was not being monitored by my teacher. So applause to my teacher. Moral of the story, always watch your back because you might have a Karen looming behind you.